This is an apple. And this is a custard apple. So it's a beautiful day here in India and as you can hear some beautiful birds in the background. I'm not really familiar with the birds on here but I know I've seen crows, peacocks, um, um, pigeons. I've actually seen um, a pelican for the first time and a weird penguin looking bird. So speaking of exotic creatures, today we are going to be reviewing some of India's exotic fruits. So first off, we have jamful. During our journey, we found jamful on the side of the road. They have them everywhere. And it's quite easy to find, especially for traveling on the highways, on, on the main roads, or even inside the cities. It, it looks like a apple. It has the consistency of of a Fijoa, thick Fijoa skin, and it tastes quite sweet. In the inside, it looks like a mini watermelon, so it's really cute. This is the first time I've tried this. It's called Jamful here in India, but apparently it's called a guava elsewhere. It's known as guava. I'm not sure because I haven't tasted a guava, <laughs> um, but they call it here. They, I think they refer to it as a guava here. It's definitely a nice thing to try. Um, it's got these hard seeds inside which taste like little stones so um, you can eat them. It's just um, a bit of teeth work. So second fruit we're going to review today is the custard apple. Uh, so the custard apple you do not need to um, cut it. You just have to grab it and pull it out. That's what it looks like on the inside. And how do I eat it? <laughs> and then just... What, bit by bit? This bit? Yeah, no, no. These bits? No, no, no. Just take a little bit of chunk out like this. Mm -hmm. And put this in your mouth. Okay. You just got to take this chunky bit here out. And you don't eat the skin. Uh, you don't eat this part. You only eat this part. Now, here we go. Oh my god, they yum. By the way, this is my first time trying this, and it is delicious. Oh, huh. I can't even, I can't even think about what they taste like. So, see these black things? You don't eat them, you spit them out. Bad mistake. If you don't want to get your hands dirty, just grab it from the outside of the shell. Otherwise, if you, if you're fine with getting your fingers dirty, just dig in, <laughs> dig in and pluck them out. So just make sure you use your tongue to work around the pips and spit them out. Now, what does it taste like? It's got a strange taste. Not a, not an uncommon one. I feel like it, what can it taste like? Mm, it's got a very creamy texture. The skin is kind of soft and slimy like like a rock melon, like a ripe rock melon. It just slides inside your mouth. It's not one of those fruits where it's an acquired taste. It's definitely, it's very delicious. It does taste like what it sounds, custard and apple. <laughs> so the last fruit that I'll be reviewing today is the dragon fruit. While it looks so interesting, it does have a very simple taste to it. The color is just so beautiful. It's like a very bright, vibrant magenta. The dragon fruit is truly a unique looking fruit. So here we have it. Uh, you can feel free to cut off the top if you want to. Nothing but a hole in there. <laughs> and then go ahead and take a nice slice make sure not to cut your fingers ah there we have it there's the inside 
it looks exactly like kiwi fruit on the inside kind of but it's a lot more paler um, the colors there I love this beautiful pink color it's vibrant so let's give it a taste so the good thing about this kiwi fruit is you can eat it exactly how kiwis eat kiwi fruit and is the only real good way to eat kiwi fruit arguably um, so you grab a spoon you spoon it out and by the way this is the first time I'm trying this I think it's strange to look at this fruit with all its like colors and then to taste kiwi fruit <laughs> it does taste like kiwi fruit it doesn't have that bitterness that kiwi fruit has or that 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 particular um, acquired taste it doesn't have that inside um, it just tastes a little bit more flavorless than kiwi fruit but it is tasty it just it doesn't have that taste but the texture is definitely there Mmm, it's definitely there. <laughs> so I hope you, so that's all for today. I hope you liked my video on the exotic fruits of Asia. If you have, if you've tried this before and you want to share your thoughts and ideas or whether you liked it, if you liked it, if you didn't like it, let me know in the comments below. And if you like this video, press the thumbs up button and subscribe to my channel. Thanks. Bye. See you next time.